Nobunaga's Ambition Sphere of Influence is a historical strategy sim set in Japan's Sengoku era, which is roughly between 1500 and 1600 AD. It's based off of historical characters like Nobunaga Oda, two whom players may be more familiar with in Koei Tecmo's other series, Samurai Warriors. While both games share similarities, let it be known that the stories within are more politically intriguing than they are fantastical. This is one for history buffs. There are multiple scenarios to start with, each with a solid campaign that could take hours or even days depending on one's pace. More or less, each campaign is about taking control of Japan through any means necessary. Players can negotiate villages, build new structures, farm, and myriad of other jobs. It's all about balance and creating a war fund. Battles play out on the map, though big sieges take on a different effect, mirroring tactical RPGs. There's a lot to handle, and even with a tutorial, it's daunting. Gamers new to the series may be lost, but fans of strategy sims like Civilization or Total War will pick it up with ease. This game is all about customizing the user experience. Players can zoom in and out of perspectives, scale the map and menus with ease, play lengthy campaigns, or just jump into skirmishes. The one thing missing is multiplayer, which could have been a great concept. The graphics leave something to be desired. They're simple, neither ugly nor pretty. They are what they are. The music though is fantastic with booming orchestrals that really enhance the battles. Nobunaga's Ambition Sphere of Influence was a puzzle to review. I've never played one of these games before, or a sim in general. It's hard to grasp at first, and it's demanding of players' time and patience in order to get anything out of it. That said, it's still a well-made game that's rewarding and a treat for history buffs. It's no Samurai Warriors, which is more akin to what I like, but it was still a delight.